welcome on Watches TV and today we're going to talk about the final edition of the FB2 T meaning round case with a tourbillon and uh, for this last edition you have actually 38 movements that will be made available with different configuration possible right yes indeed um, three well we're presenting three different colors of gold here three different dials and uh, obviously uh, I'm sure we will make even more uh, individual watches but the fact is 38 movements and not one more and uh, what I find really interesting about this final edition is that the bridges are made of sapphire so you can truly admire not only the workmanship but the architecture of uh -huh. the famous this famous caliber yes. which um, put uh, put us on the map Absolutely. So I mean, speak. it's really going back to the very first uh, models introduced. Uh, yes. When was that? Well, five, six years ago? Seven years ago? What? 2015. 2015. Right. Time so flies. Time flies. Yeah, that really does. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, in two years, we will be celebrating the 10th anniversary of the renaissance of uh, Ferdinand Berthoud. That's a nice uh, milestone for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and things have evolved really nicely in such yes. a short period of time, actually. Yes, we are, uh, yeah, I would say very much in demand right now and uh, we can't really, we can't really grasp it yet uh, and follow up uh, with production. So um, unfortunately for some it's frustrating now because we have some um, waiting time. Um, but all in all, it shows that uh, uh, Ferdinand Berthoud has not lost any of, of uh, the great interest um, that people already had in the 18th century. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good thing. And uh, regarding indeed the personalization that will be, be possible, what are you offering, for instance? Well, there can be other case materials mm -hmm. um, and maybe a little bit another finish of the movement, but uh, already now we are offering you know three different dials so um the more individual the watch gets the longer the waiting time will yeah. be <laughs> of course <laughs> yeah. so there is a downside to that yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. Yes. Mm. and uh indeed regarding this recognition by the the collectors uh mm. is that something that you anticipated is really or it, it, it is it went kind of beyond your expectations well you cannot plan this no. uh, you can i i was obviously hoping and also anticipating an interest because of I think our approach being uh, uh, yeah I could I could call it really perfectionist mm -hmm. and uh, uh, we we put the bar very high in terms of finish and uh, so yeah altogether the package uh, we we are proposing is is, is quite unique uh, so yes I was I was anticipating appreciation but this has uh, goes far beyond what what i expected well i just ran before into uh, a mutual friend of ours mr philip dufour who apparently was here with you this morning yes and yes, uh, yes. Mm. he seemed to be really impressed by what you're doing yes he i think uh, he he was catching up with uh, well the fp3 uh -huh. which he hadn't we, had, we hadn't seen yet i think and uh, and this model of course and yes, he was. He, I think he was impressed. Yes, I think you know, could say that. Yeah. Uh, I, I could interpret that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. No, mm -hmm. that was. Uh, no, he uh, was. For, for me personally, this is a, a great compliment coming imagine. from him. Yeah. I can imagine. Mm -hmm. Well, really, congratulations to you and your team. Uh, you. to, and talking about the team, actually, the fact of having this higher demand, uh, does it mean that you've also increased uh, the, the number of collaborators working solely on the Ferdinand Berthoud? Yes, well, we have added since uh, two watchmakers, uh, and in particular, the team that is working on the movement decoration has been increased. But uh, it's not an easy task. Um, the level being very high, uh, first we have to really teach uh, new collaborators, you know, how to tackle uh, our level of decoration. Mm -hmm. But uh, but I think the challenge is also what attracts them mm -hmm. yeah, and uh, what what makes the job uh, 
so interesting. Yeah. Definitely, mm. yeah. Well, the good thing about being a final edition means that there is something new that is probably cooking right now. And uh, we're really looking forward uh, yes. being able to see this in the future. Thank you very much for having us. Thank you. Thank you.